I'm delighted, uh, but somewhat daunted as well, to have been nominated to the Sea of Norwich. I'm really looking forward to getting to know uh, Norfolk and Waveney, the villages, the market towns, the coastal areas, the very life of the city of Norwich as well, being known by people and getting to know them. As I've been reading some of the works of Mother Julian of Norwich in recent weeks, I keep being inspired by how she speaks about the Christian life being one that's filled with awe, with humility and with love. And I'm looking forward to leading a diocese that follows the God of awe in Jesus Christ. How that story of his life and death, his resurrection and ascension, should fill us with awe and wonder as we seek to follow him. And I'm looking forward to sharing that story with more people, particularly young people, so that we may be a church that grows. A church that grows also can serve its community in great humility. There'll be some tough questions to ask in future years, ways of supporting ministry across rural places, how we really encourage the life of the church and the transformation of our communities in some of our urban areas. And we seek to do that, following Christ in humbleness. Mother Julian of Norwich also spoke about the Christian life being one that's filled with love. And that's why I passionately believe that the church should be the place for the last, the lost and the lonely, for they are welcomed into the kingdom of God. That's why churches across Norfolk and Waveney are places serving their communities. And I very much look forward to joining in with that. All I ask, please, is that you pray for me at this time of transition, so that this journey together with God may be a joyous adventure.